welcome back. Second way that God gives you his grace, his forgiveness, his super abundant love is this is basically like right there. It's hard, hard to miss this one. And it is the spoken gospel, the very spoken good news to you. So we're, we're baptized into Christ, children of paradise, forgiven all of our sins. But do we abide in that grace? Do we, do we stay in it our whole life and go, you know what, I'm going to walk in newness of life every day? Well, no, we, we desire to, but we fail at it. We, we jump out of the ship and we swim as far away from it as we can. So instead of getting re-baptized, you know, oh, I got to get baptized again to get, you know, start over at square one, like in Candyland, right? You ever play Candyland and, and you get all the dots and then you get that one, I think it's the gingerbread guy right at the beginning and you're all the way to the vanilla cone. It's like, thanks a lot, gingerbread. And that's, you know, but we don't go back to gingerbread. We don't go back to the beginning like Vicini would have us do. We don't do that. Instead, we're brought back into our baptism. We don't get rebaptized. Like, okay, now, now this is where we're at. We're brought back into our baptismal grace, in the words of holy absolution, the spoken gospel. That's where I talked about combining them. I'm combining the spoken gospel and absolution. When you look at this, your pastor speaks not on his own authority, but in the stead of Christ. So it's literally Jesus standing there saying, you are forgiven your sins. Those sins you have committed since those forgiving waters and holy baptism, you are absolutely 100% Loved, forgiven, and claimed anew, and restored to that life of grace. That good news is spoken to you over and over and over again. We're never re-baptized, but we hear these words of absolution every day as often as possible. Every single time we can, we hear them so that we may rest assured that no matter how far we've jumped out of the boat and tried swimming away, Christ comes with that life preserver of holy absolution and brings us back in. So be at peace, my friends. You are forgiven. It's spoken to you. It's declared. And if it's declared, it's absolute. God bless you all. We'll see you next time. Thank you for watching Higher Things Video Shorts. If you're looking for an easy way to support Higher Things, remember to like, share, and subscribe. And hit that bell icon for content notifications. You can follow Higher Things on social media and on our website, higherthings.org. If you love what we're doing, we ask that you remember us in your prayers and donations.